In one way or another, artificial intelligence is becoming part of our daily lives, and that now includes on our highways. Good afternoon. I'm Natalie Wilson. And I'm Neil McNeil. The North Carolina Highway Patrol is now using AI to identify distracted commercial drivers. It's been in place since the spring. <laughs> It's here. It's here. All the way from Australia, all the way to the United States. It has landed right there in North Carolina on I-40, I believe. I think I've seen, uh, I seen a few of them on I-40 heading into North Carolina. If you don't pay attention, you'll miss it. And that is the whole point of the AccuSensus AI camera for commercial vehicles yep they cracking down seat belt violators they're catching you cell phone holders can't hide i used to hold the phone down up under the window can't hide these cameras ai look directly into your cab see exactly what you're doing if you're touching the tablet they're gonna catch you got your cell phone in your hand they're gonna catch you and they're gonna catch you without you even thinking that's the whole point of these cameras. So shout out to a truck driver uh, on YouTube. He shared his uh, stop with a, Carol a North Carolina trooper, pulled him over in the rain. Trooper got out, did a level two inspection and came over to him and gave him a citation, an actual citation at that. So he, he got a violation on the, on the inspection report as well as a ticket he he has a ticket so he got the opportunity to fight the ticket but i don't think he's going to actually beat it because that the sense the census camera is digital proof of him not wearing his seat belt no more wasting time let's get it hold on well, i just got pulled over in uh i think i'm in north carolina, I'm in north carolina just north of uh charlotte and uh i'm just rolling dot jumped out on me it's raining too. And he pulled me over. And I'm like, am I speeding? He's like, nah. I'm like, what the fuck you pulling me over for? No, nah, this dude pulling me over in the rain. I wasn't speeding. I'm I'm like, it's 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 raining, so I know I'm going extra slow. And the truck had just got on the highway, so I got over. So I could let the truck on. And then uh, I'm rolling like in the it's, I don't know what y'all can see. It's like five lanes right here. So I'm like in the second lane. Rolling. And uh, I see the cop coming up in the fast lane over there, hauling ass. I see a lot of cars getting over, a lot of cars getting over. So I'm like, oh, what's going on? So he ended up getting behind me. I'm like, what the fuck? Behind me for? And I asked him what I was doing. He said nothing. He's just doing the inspection. I'm like, what you just doing the inspection for in the rain? Like, that don't make any sense. Like, you can't even really do an inspection for real in the rain because you're getting wet. I'm like, what? Well, we're going to see. We're going to see. I'm going to put this camera right here. Yeah. <clears throat> 15 minutes later. Hi, Mr. Patrick. Oh, man. All right, let me see. You mind, is this okay? So this right here, there's your book back. Mm -hmm. And I put your shipping papers right there. Okay. There's that. This right here is your driver's license bag, so I'll move those. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is what we're doing today. Is this thing called AccuCensus. I don't know if you've heard about it or not. No. Uh, back about the like, 70 mile marker, there's an orange pole out there. And uh, it takes pictures as you're coming by mm -hmm. and we've got pictures of you not wearing your seatbelt so i like to show truck drivers this as you're coming through yeah right there there's no strap coming across your shoulder and then on the next picture the, the next the next the next picture is better there's no strap coming across your shoulder right there. yeah yeah and did you forget to put it on day or what happened? yeah raining getting fuel I, I i jumped back in the truck Taking my jacket off, all this kind of stuff. I saw you just started driving not too long ago. Yeah, so. I got you. So I, I did do it like a level three inspection on you. Um, I did do a violation. I failed to use a seat belt while operating the CMV, okay? Um, this right here is your inspection sheet. What you do is make sure that you sign your. This ring. Got me. Uh, so basically, what you do is make sure you sign your name there and there uh, before you turn this into your safety director, supervisor, mm -hmm. whoever y'all turn these things into. And then they sign off on it knowing that you had this violation and then they keep it on their file for one year okay so there's that there's no fines or anything like that just a violation so this, now, so this is a moving violation right that on the cmv on. side 
It's just a violation, no fines. I'm about to go work with Walmart, so I don't, I don't have to report this. On the criminal, on the criminal side, we are writing citations for, for guys not wearing their seat belts or women not wearing their seat belts and uh, having cell phones in their hands and stuff like that. So on the civil side, you get to keep that. That's y'all's copy you turn into your carrier. On that side, there's no fines or nothing like that. It's just a violation. It could affect your CVSA score. It may not. Who knows? But it could. There's no no fines on that. Either. On the criminal side, this right here is a citation for not wearing your seatbelt. Okay. Mm -hmm. Your court date is going to be in Rowan County on Friday, February 2nd, 2024 at 8.30 a.m. Now, when you start reading option and waiver instructions, you do not have to appear. Okay? Mm -hmm. Either take care of it by the show court date if you want to, or you can go online right here at this website, or go by the clerk's office and pay the citation off before the court date, mm -hmm. or you can turn this over to an attorney. Just make sure you do something with it, because I don't want you to get your driver's license revoked or anything like that. Just make sure you take care of it. On this side, on the criminal side, no points for your driver's license. There are any issues. Okay, it's just a, it's just a fine. It's okay. a fraction, but no points for your driver's license or any insurance on the criminal side. Okay, so there's that. Uh, do you run through here a lot? Okay, I was going to tell you. I'm telling all truck drivers, tell your friends, this thing's gonna be here through Thursday. Okay. Okay. We're not moving it. It's not going anywhere. Tell everybody. I don't care. Right. Uh, but it's only on the northbound side. Okay. Uh, just make sure you wear a seatbelt. And, you know what I mean? And don't right. don't. Put your seatbelt on, put your phone on your hand. You didn't do that, but I'm just saying, that's what this thing detects. Uh, it started in Australia. Let's give a little quick synopsis about it. It started in Australia, and it was it done great. It brought down fatality rates and all the stuff in wrecks and stuff like that with truck drivers and with cars. And now they've moved this company over to the United States. And we are, North Carolina's the first, we're the test pilot. Okay. So we're going to Georgia, and it's, it's moving. Okay. And they're hoping in, in the next three to four years that it'll be in every state across the United States. Oh. Mobile ones and ones that are permanent, they're, they're like maybe a way station or something like that. that's what they're kind of looking at. Mm -hmm. Technology's here, it's Big Brother watching us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard something about this in Tennessee. It was like, okay. Big Brother's here. Okay. Big Brother's watching. All right. And, uh, so I just want you to know that in the future, because I never, I don't want this to ever happen to you again. Okay. Just know this stuff's out here. You never know where it's at. Mm -hmm. And it, 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 it takes pictures, and it's just, it's, it's a great technology, it is, but I also don't want truck drivers to get in trouble. So just make yeah, sure you wear your seatbelt at all times. Maybe this will be something you might remember to do every so then to keep yourself Okay. Going. In the video, as we can hear, the officer is explaining to him the difference between the civil side and the CMV side. CMV side, of course, is on the inspection sheet, probably a hit on his CSA points. Uh, luckily for him, he didn't have his uh, his cell phone in his hand. He was doing up under the speed limit. He was just driving, minding his business. He got pulled over. Don't know why. He want to do an inspection in the rain. Like, you really want to do an inspection in the rain? But, of course, the AccuSense's AI camera called him without the seatbelt. And how this camera system works, well, let, let, let the news explain how, how this camera system works. So the dr devices are placed on high traffic roads for commercial vehicles and the, they will take images of the commercial drivers in violation of the hands-free law. The photo will be taken and sent to state troopers. NC Highway Patrol is using three AccuSenses heads up solution devices placed across the state along I-40. The cameras are only monitoring commercial drivers and will take photos of the passing truck's plates and capture images of the driver inside the cab. It is looking for hands-free and seatbelt violations. Unlike passenger vehicle drivers, commercial drivers have to be hands-free at all times when driving. The AI devices are mobile and can be relocated. Plus, there's no schedule for where they're placed. A state trooper sits in a location past the device and will get an alert within seconds when there is a violation, and they can pull up the photo and review it. If there is evidence of a violation, they will stop the truck as it passes. Fines up to $100 could be issued. A spokesperson with State Highway Patrol said last week in the Hickory area, in a 30-minute period, they had more than five violations. The photos taken by the devices will not be shared with any other agency outside of North Carolina Highway Patrol, and the total cost of the three devices being used is $495,000. Live in Greensboro, Celeste Smith, Fox 8 News. What did what, she say? 500? Five violations in 30 minutes. These new AI technology is here, y'all. It's here and it's here to stay. Five. It's the jumpstart 
It came from across the way, and now it's here in the States. It's the first state to start the program, and I guarantee you, probably by the summertime, I'm thinking Ohio is going to be next. <laughs> what do you guys think, man? I think Ohio is going to be next. Now, I know some of you truck drivers out there is feeling some kind of way. And I, I, I couldn't agree with you more. Evasion of privacy. Well, you could probably have your little your little boo thing, probably half naked. You probably might be rubbing her down. You pass the camera without even noticing, and boom, there you have it. All, all for the pleasures of the, the troopers to see. But if you're a cautious driver, you're you're a safe driver, seatbelt paying attention to the road doing what you, you're supposed to do then i guess you don't have too much to worry about but i'm telling you now drivers going through better keep your eyes open because they're mobile they're not just going to be on the north side or the south side it's going to be wherever they decide to put it at because it's mobile maybe one week it'll be on the north side down by mile marker whatever and then the following week, they're going to put it on the other side. But they is the test pilot for this program. Once it's all over and all said and done with the money that they're going to be making from it, they're going to order more. And again, it's going to migrate to different states. So drivers, this a shout out to this YouTuber. He wants you guys to know. He wants you guys to be on the lookout. He wants you guys to, to know that they're out there watching and they're going to catch you if you're not paying attention. So AccuSenses, AI is here. AI is staying. AI is not going nowhere. The professional driver, commercial vehicles, totally on a different level. So if you head down, you better keep your eyes open. And your seatbelt on. Uh, in too deep like Omar. Make me want to track you down and hit the track hawk with the crowbar. I knew we wouldn't go far, like we ran out of ethanol. Now your nosy ass mama want to get involved. When I met you, you was on the couch with the plastic. She need an Emmy. Bitch so dramatic. Now your baggage got me on edge like jagged. Fucking up my homes, look Patrick. You swift to jump shift like a chief. Been crying on my line like Therese. But it ain't all you, it's me. Blame it on the things I went through.